So, I haven't done one of these in like a year, but I am drunk. I'm drunk and worried. And I'm 21. If I want to drink my problems away, I can. Uh, basically, I have surgery. I have top surgery in two days. Today is the night. Well, it's like 1 a.m. now. Maybe 2 a.m. Uh, Saturday night. And I have surgery Tuesday morning. Oh, there's my cat. Oh, my baby boy. I have surgery Tuesday morning. I had my consults June 2nd, I think, which was uh, about two weeks earlier than what I thought it was, and everything went as expected. It was amazing. I was shaky and fidgety all over the place, but everything was good, and surgery's coming up. I saved up all my money. I went on welfare because <laughs> I had to pay for the surgery. So I saved as much money as I possibly could, and it's here. I paid for it a few weeks ago with my partner's visa, because my bank doesn't accept welfare as a payment method for credit cards, and you can only pay with credit cards or checks, which, who uses checks nowadays? I know how to write a check because of my old math teacher, but no clue how I would go about getting checks. So, also my mobility has declined quite a bit, so I am sitting in a wheelchair right now, which I've tricked out. Oh man, oh no. It was in my legs, okay. Which I've tricked out, because if I'm going to be in a wheelchair, I'm going to trick it out. And now I'm all backwards. So I sewed covers for it and everything like that to get ready, and I'm packing, and I've got all my medications, which were vastly not covered by OHIP. So that's about $50 out of my own pocket, which there's not. My pockets aren't very deep. And, but it's okay. It's okay. I'm doing okay. At this point, I am most scared of intubation. <laughs> I don't like the thought of not being able to breathe on my own. I don't like that it could injure me. I I just don't like the thought of it at all. One tiny little bit. Don't like it. But, oh god, I'm so drunk. I shouldn't be drinking at all. But, ugh, sometimes you get scared. And this is like my third time drinking alone in my life, so I count that as a success, even though it'd make my old therapist really upset, and I think that's what stops me from doing it a lot of times. But I'm staying, my surgery is with <laughs> Dr. McEvan Yu at the McLean Clinic in Mississauga. I should have said that earlier. It is for September 4th at 9 a.m., and I am staying at the uh, Novato Hotel for the 3rd, 4th, and 5th. Uh, we're going there a day early so that we don't have to uh, drive super early and so that, if we're being honest, so that I can enjoy the hot tub. I love baths, I love hot water, they ease my achy joints, <laughs> but... In fact, at the end of this, I will include a video of me in my new uh, power wheelchair. This is my knee, by the way, my, knee, my legs are crossed. Uh, I'll include a video of me in my new power wheelchair that I got a few days ago. Uh, it's secondhand from Kijiji, but I got it for $300 when it would originally be like 3500 So, I'm very happy with that. The dude who had it before me took the speed cap out, so now it goes very fast. Uh, yeah, this is just sort of an update. That surgery is happening in a few days. Not even a few days. It's a couple days. It's like 48 hours. I'm having a time. I've been time in my life, but uh, I guess I'll take as much video as I can from the surgical center and in the hotel because 
it's hard to see those videos, and I know that I really benefited from the few that I've seen. So, I'll update you guys with that. But, thanks, friends, and people who watch this. <laughs> so, see you in a week. So, I just adjusted the chair a little bit. Cool. Oh. I'm sick now.